everybody, it's Felix and Lucien here from the Tennis Brothers. In this video, we're going to be unboxing these shoes. They are the Nike Air Zoom Vapor 10 clay shoes. Now, something really cool I wanted to mention about these shoes before we start is that Nike worked with Tennis Point to create these limited edition shoes that you can only find on Tennis Point. So that's really good and it allows us to show you guys um, well, the limited edition shoes that can only be found there. So let's get into it. Yeah, let's unbox them. Okay, so... Obviously, Nike. My size is 7.5 UK. And wow, these look absolutely amazing. So obviously, we have the blue, white, and we have this yellow kind of light green. I'm not sure what kind of that neon. Is. It looks a bit like neon yellow. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It looks nice. very nice. So very do you nice actually shoe. know who um, designed these shoes? No, I don't actually. So it was a man named Tinker Hatfield. Um, he worked on the Air Jordans from 3 to 15 and he actually to start with created the Air Zoom Vapor 9s which kind of combined a tennis shoe and a running shoe and then he worked with Roger Federer to create the 9.5s and now the 10s which are here. But Federer added his touch to it and he's been playing with these shoes when he's won 17 major titles and 83 tournaments um, so that record kind of stands for itself to show how good these shoes are and also yeah. 25 Grand Slams have been won by all the players wearing these shoes such as Victoria Azarenka, Petra Kvitova, Maria Sharapova and obviously Roger Federer. So they have a good record don't they? Yeah. So let's go on to the design. So this is the herringbone sole and it's blue tick with the white obviously and as usual there's always protection here because that's when most shoes break. There you go. And I really like about the shoe, first of all, I really like different types of blues. So here's a kind of darker blue and here's a more vibrant blue. And it all stands out and goes together really nicely. So um, obviously here is a nice tick. I always love these ticks on here. Always personalization. And it is green because of the Tennis Point limited edition shoe. So it says here, Nike Zoom. So also the the durability that they've created on the shoe because obviously it's a clay shoe and on clay you're changing direction and sliding yeah. so they've created a really durable um, as Lucian said herringbone design on the bottom and also very stable outer sole um, and that basically allows you to be able to move uh, freely without having a sense of you're gonna fall over. Something I do, I think it's only on my left foot when I'm sliding, I drag this foot, so as Lucian mentioned also, that's a very durable part of the shoe which allows it not to break down. Yeah. Something Federer also said or wanted in the shoe was that it's become a lot more lightweight since the Vapor 9s. Yeah. Something I also like, it's very responsive to your foot so you can run really quickly and accelerate and that's obviously something you need to do quickly on a clay court especially because you're always changing direction and moving because it's such a demanding demanding surface. Third thing I wanted to say, it's got a customised <laughs> fit in the upper part of the shoe, it's called the dynamic fit system. Um, so basically what this allows is your shoe or your foot to kind of mould into the shoe, uh, which allows it to obviously feel better as Lucy mentioned. So let's go on to the fit. So obviously every single Nike shoe I have worn is fit really nicely and as soon as I wear it, some shoes give you blisters, but these shoes never have given me blisters. And I think this is a really slick design. This is my second or third pair of these and I'm, I'm, these are getting used to my feet. So these are getting really comfortable. I know how to play with these. I know what I can and can't do. So let's go on to the ankle support. So the ankle support is very strong. Unlike other shoes, it is a lot stronger. And obviously there is the little bit here where you can do the laces for more protection. And I can't really move it around too much. It's very sturdy and so your foot just sits and it doesn't move too much around the shoe. That's what some shoes I hate about some shoes. So this is my first pair of Nike Zoom Vapor 10s. I had a, a pair of Nike Cages, I believe, a while ago, but hopefully these will feel better on my foot. The other ones felt amazing as well. Um, so let's see how these compare. So talking about lightweight, the Vapor 10s are lighter than the Vapor 9s. And personally, that really helps me because I can move quicker around the court. I can change direction. And especially when you're just getting to that drop shot, I always use this. Just You can just get to that drop shot and just edge it back in. Make that one last ball if the shoes are a bit lighter. So that's what I really like about light shoes. So last of all, we have a new system in place to rank our shoes in the next year. 
So, what we are going to do is we are going to rate every single design of the shoe out of five, and then we are going to rate the play test or how well they fit and comfortable and everything that is taken into account for a shoe out of five. And we'll do it out of ten and we'll have a table to see which shoes we like and which shoes we think you should get. And so let's see what you rate this out of five. So are we going to do an average of our two or are we just going to do one as an overall or one each? Let's do a rank out of five each. It has to be a whole number. Okay. And, and then we'll merge the two. Okay, so okay. you get an average. Um, so looking at these shoes, they are very nice. And I think what gives it the edge is this limited edition from Tennis Point. There'll be a link in the description where you can go buy them for yourselves and stand out when you're playing. So that's why I'm, I'm going to give these shoes a four. really like the design. I haven't owned a pair of these shoes. I like how they look. What do you think? Okay, so onto me, I really love, as Felix says, the green and all of the different shades of blues and whites. I love the sole, looks absolutely amazing. So without further ado, I'm going to give it a four, like Felix. So that is a four on average. So these shoes have scored four out of five. So let's see what we give them with the play test. So we gave these a four out of five. We're going to be making a video and ranking them out of five for the play test. Make sure to turn bell notifications on next to the subscribe button to not miss when that video comes out and to like the video if you enjoyed it. We'll be doing loads more tennis point shoe unboxings in the future. So stay tuned for that. I'll see you in the next video. Make sure you subscribe. Bye. Do you think it's too windy to play? I don't know.